All right, here's a way you could um, use a Google Doc presentation in a screen recording with um, QuickTime to build up part of a video. So, for example, let's say I want to make a video about Iowa and products in Iowa. Well, I've got my Google Doc open and I'm going to do File, New Window, open a new window in Google or in uh, Firefox, and do a search. I'm going to search for Iowa map. Okay, and then go to my image tab up here in the upper left hand corner. I got a whole bunch of different maps of Iowa. And I'm going to shrink my window down here a little bit so that I can slide it off to the side so that I can go back and forth between these two windows. So I'm going to find a map here I like and just hold over it and then click and hold and drag it onto my Google Doc and there it's there. Now I also want some products so maybe I do a search for corn and find an image of corn that I want to use. I like this one so drag it over and let's do one more. Let's do pigs. and find an image I like, hold over it, drag it over. Now I click back on that window and here's these images. Now I want to use the map of Iowa kind of as a background so I'm going to drag it out over this whole slide area and I'm going to, I'm done with my other window, I got the pictures I want so I'm going to open this up and I'm going to take these pictures and drag them off to the side and the idea is that Later on, uh, as I, I'm recording this screen, I can drag these pictures on as I talk about something. And then when I put this in iMovie, I can actually crop it down so it only shows this window. So these things I'm dragging off to the side won't show at all. Now, the only thing you have to be careful with is that notice if I drag this over and then drag this over, see how the window jumps? Because the slider bar went away because I no longer had things hanging off the edge of the screen. So you kind of always want to you know, try it a little bit first, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to this image of corn and do a command C, command B is in victory and paste that there. So I, I'm going to have one of those that just stays there and kind of holds the place. That way my screen won't jump. So as I want to talk about this video of Iowa, I talk about how we grow corn and I slide over my picture corn click real quick to get rid of the border around it. Continue on, talk about hog production, click real quick, talk about the, the, they see that come up, etc. So when I'm done with our presentation, then or done with what I want to do, I can just stop my QuickTime recording. Okay, here I've started up iMovie. I've created a new project and a new event and I've imported that video that I made from the um, Google Doc presentation where I slid on the pictures. But I don't want this whole window to show, I just want the area of the map to show. So I can go here to my clip, pull down the little blue wheel, go to cropping and rotation.